hello friends today we are going to learn how to create a password hash for this program so first of all we have to create a register form so that you can, can, can register here for this purpose we have to include three levels level 1 level 2 level 3 three text boxes text box 1 text box 2 text box 3 and one button let's rename all these level 1 which is username level 2 which is password level 3 which is re enter password This is the register button. Here we are going to SHA1 encryption. To use any encryption in .NET framework, you have to include uh, had, uh, namespace using system dot security dot cryptography. But we have also uh, it will to be database, so we have to include the file using system dot data security. System dot data dot SQL client because we are going to use the SQL server for saving the data into database. First, we have to check the two text boxes have the same value or not. It means password and re enter the password will have the same value or not. For this, we have to check text box 2 dot x dot trim so that name uh, white species can be trimmed. Three dot text dot three. If they have, if they have the same value, then our code will get executed. So first of all, we create the hash of the password. For this purpose, we have to use SHA Crypto Service Provider. SHA Crypto Service Provider. SHA for the new. We are going to use UTF and UTF pattern coding. We are going to store the pass hash format in a string. We are going to use bit converter. We can use here text box 2 or text box 3 because both have the same value as we have already checked here. So I am going to use text box 3. Now we have to create a database connection. So SQL connection. We have to pass the connection string here. Data source. It means for the data we have to save our data. In, in my case, it is SQL Server Initial Catalog. 
which is the database name in my case it is test integrated security if your database is running on the over the network you have to include your username and password instead of integrated security we have to pass SQL command object insert into secure our table name is secure as you, as you can see here it is a secure data table name username values Go to the connection class of connection object which is found. User name is coming from our text box one dot text. Xbox One contains our username, and we have to include. We have to insert the password in hash format. The hash is created here, which is stored in hash string. So we have to we have to pass password here. and is coming from the hash string Come open the connection we have to come dot execute non query for the connection Or we now created this is the first part of our application uh, in, in which we are, we are inserting the password in the host and the hash format in the database. So we have to check it run the application. Username is new. 
पहले से पासवर्ड मांगते हैं ये तो पासवर्ड ही मांगते हैं ये फॉर्मेट टेन पीड़ का सक्सेस मैसेज है यार सो वो टेन पीड़ का सक्सेस मैसेज है डेटिंग सेकंड सक्सेस क्वीन नारन डेटिंग अच्छी Let's check the data is inserted or not into the database. So we are here. Which is our database? The database is secure. Let's refresh the database. There is our secure data. Let's check the data is here or not. As you can see here, it has format of our has format of our password. I I entered the password. Password Maria. Then the has created is. created is this which is 20 bytes in size as you can see that here I enter the password of Moria and in the database the password inserted as in this has format so this is the first part of application in which we have created a form to register the user and its password is stored in the database in the has format in our next video and we have to create a form where the user can log in and the hash is checked to hash and if the both hash are compared and found correct then the user get the, then the user get login into the second form thanks for watching the video second video will be uploaded very soon thank you friends